All right, and we begin. So, uh, two things of note. I have made a calendar, as we all know. And today marks Laura the 14th. And last time, all we really did was kill some spiders, so I think we can just jump in for today. Yes. Did we get AXP for that? Uh, I did I did send you guys the, the message. It was 400. It, uh, right? Yeah. But it's after a long rest. Yes. Which we have not had yet. Oh, okay. All right. Hold on. Oh. Okay. Well, you can mark it, but it's fine. Uh, last we left off, you guys were just getting a short rest and mm -hmm. waiting for your next class, which Tsunami has told you is going to be hunting. Because... All the animals in the prey center were killed by a couple of spiders. Yay! I mean, to be fair, they were like dimensional hopping bullshit spiders. Fair enough. Either way, the day is all yours. If you guys want to talk about anything, Orpheus in Powder's room is just kind of dying inside. Dying inside, I guess. He's having his own little episode, just thinking to himself. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to my mud bath and start praying. Start. <laughs> While waiting in the mud. <laughs> oh, you did that last time. Yeah. Oh, right, right I did. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you I'm going to see if I can prepare a meal. Yeah. Uh, you probably won't have that <laughs> much time since you guys did just finish like an hour of a short rest. Yeah. There is an entire cave you guys, or mountain you guys have not really explored yet. It's like shit, it's a. I'm going to. I'm going to explore the mountain. Oh, I missed it. You have a bit of time before your next thing, so yeah. I see. Stop, bro. What's up, guys? Will anyone go with Mud Puppy? Oh, it's cut out. Out. Oh, will anyone go with Mud Puppy? Discord cut out when Cheesy was explaining what she was going to do. So I did not catch anything. I'm just gonna go That's explore the uh, forward mountain. mountain. The mountain. Hmm. Sure, I will. <laughs> I have nothing better to do. We're going to explore the hmm. or never forget that work is kind of sus. Never forget. <laughs> never forgetty. <laughs> So yeah, Mud Puppy has uh, just walked out the main tunnel. Mm -hmm. Give me a second to move. Roll 20 is being very slow for me today.
Oh. I'm gonna s continue the practice with the Tantan in my room. All right. So Squall is just in the room with you, and you pull out this big old narrow little drum. Presumably still laying in your hammock. And you just start bongling away at the tan sand. <laughs> Will anyone else go with the two? Or just them two? Hmm. All right, okay, so Mud Puppy and Rosary are going for a little walk through the mountain. I hope you're having a great day, great time so far in this beautiful, lovely. I mean, I was honestly expecting a lot worse, but so far I'm pleasantly surprised. Yeah. <laughs> There's no way things could possibly get any worse in here. Just You're so going to jinx it. I hope you know that. What me? What, what a paladin such as myself really be able to jinx it? I can't. Uh, <laughs> you'd be surprised. Fuck. That fucking has a massive grin. <laughs> Out of the other tunnel, you can see a Nightwing currently just walking out. Uh, my uh yes. You, you recognize this as Mighty Claws, who's uh, been sitting around with ba by you. Hey, my, is it? Hey, Mighty. I reach over and wave. Hey. He'll approach. We <laughs> hope menacingly. Menacingly. He doesn't look very menacing. He's precious. <laughs> He's. Uh, do you need something? See, like, I just came around. Say hi. Want to join us on a walk on exploring this mountain? Oh. Uh, without all of the uh, ghosts, yeah. Yeah. That sounds. All right. Do you want me to fetch by you? She's in the room. Our, yeah. Uh, I don't mind. Okay. Yoshi. <laughs> Yoshi. Just wait here. I'll be right back. Oh. He'll storm off and go get her. Oh. Here they come. Oh. oh, what was that? <laughs> oh. Are you okay? It's like he's dying. He's dying. <laughs> ben. No, Bio comes up. Are you guys okay? I heard. We were told there were some crazy spiders attacking. Yeah, it's like, yeah, we took good care of that. Right, Rosary? Yeah, we took good care of that. There should be no more spiders down there. <laughs> if there is, I will smite them by the eh, in the name of the earth. <laughs> well, if that's the case, I definitely feel a little bit safer knowing you're around. Uh... But we can get back to what we were looking for. We heard there was actually a ghost. Oh. Oh. Mighty Claus says, we were already told it's not actually a ghost, but she's caught up on it being a ghost. Because it totally is! <laughs> yeah, it's like, I mean, he's just sweating. Sweats and seeing them disappearing 
reappear like five different times now. Oh, we're not talking about I spiders. Mean... I mean, an actual ghost is probably a dragon. A ghost? Oh. What dragon ghost is it? I don't know. I haven't seen it yet, and I want to. Take me! Ooh, take us, take us, take us! Maybe I could talk to it. it. Talk to a ghost? I yeah. thought about just looking at it from afar. Hmm. Okay, let's, uh, it was down in the lower cave, so we can go that way. <laughs> You're excuse me. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Perfect timing! <laughs> That was a big one, Lime. If that was you, <laughs> wasn't me. Oh, was that, then. I'm no fucking clue. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, these uh, two are going downstairs. If anyone else wants to, is gonna do anything up here, I don't think so. Did the deal return? <laughs> Okay, no, we didn't. Uh, we'll move on then. Uh, Squall, you saw them talking about possibly going downstairs. You didn't really hear everything. Are you gonna follow them? Yeah. I don't, I don't know. know. I guess. Yeah. You can. Probably better than sitting around. <laughs> Waiting for uh, hunting to start. That said, we'll just go ahead and do this. And make sure. And I need to find. Okay. Uh, where did Rosary disappear to on this page? <laughs> she got eaten. Problem solved. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, I need to re add Rosary here. And. Okay. All right, I'm going to move you guys downstairs now. For the few that are going to be there. <laughs> Or how the fuck do I get in there? Um, I don't see my token anywhere. You don't see this one? <laughs> I don't see my token. I see everyone else. There we go. Yeah, you should. E, now I see it. As you come out, you can see uh, the skywing from earlier that was burning all the webs. Leap. Leaping over the fence here. I thought you were going to say burning alive. <laughs> it looks like she's burning alive. All the smoke mm -hmm. coming off of her. Ah, yes. And she's going your way now. But she uh, stops about right here and just waits for everybody to move. Uh, move. They're here. I'm, I'm just going to put them out of the way because they're not here. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello again. The sky <clears throat> Uh, You guys have got her name, Peril. I 
How did it say? Well, hello there. Hello. Hi. Are you guys coming through? Um. Yeah. It's like, it's like, um. Like, it's like, are we going to, are we going to swear the other way? Whispers over to Michael's. Are we going to swear the other way? Uh, it's this way. Are we going the right way? It's this way. Yeah. I heard. Oh, that way? Oh. Well, we hear rumors that there was a ghost dragon here. Type of dragon? We don't know. I. Uh, yeah. I haven't heard of anything like that. I didn't, I didn't either until my sweet little sister brought it up to me. And mighty, and mighty claws. We only heard about it today. Yeah. Because one of the others mentioned it, and we were just—I just happened to listen in. Yeah. It should be this way. But we don't really know where exactly. We only heard it's around here, so we just came looking. I mean, if all those spells, yeah. we could just split up, but that's a terrible idea. I mean, we can go in little groups. Me and Mighty Claws are pretty good together. Yeah. You want to join us, Peril? Uh, no, no thanks. I gotta get back to fine clay. Okay. Alright, see you later, girls. Bye. May the earth be with you. And then, Squall, as she passes you, you can just feel the heat. It's like... <laughs> and she's gone. Upstairs. Okay. Uh, we'll go this way. You guys can find a, a different way. Hmm. <laughs> Do you want to go up or through the middle? Do -do -do -do. Looks down through the middle. I think they went down through the middle. Wait, are we splitting them now? Well, they just went downstairs or down and they said to find a different path. So. Yeah, let's go. In, yeah, let's try the middle. Yeah. All right. That sounds like a better idea than nothing. As you guys go up here, you can see a dark cave to the right. There is no light coming from there. Hmm. <laughs> Do you want to go to the path that has no light or the path that might have some light? Uh, I do not. If only <laughs> I had a lamp. Wait, can I just give Mud Puppy Night Vision because of my uh, cleric claws? You definitely can. And Squall's here too. Yeah, everyone, kind of yeah, come here. Am, come am, here I technically, am I technically a lamp? Yes, you can. You can light up. You have the ability to. Yeah. It saves well, in which case, I'll give my puppy some night vision. So, <laughs> my okay. puppy can... You can give up to seven people night vision, I believe, right? Yes. You give, the, give the whole party well, night vision. I technically I give already these... have it. Oh, yes. Yeah. So, it only makes sense to benefit Cheesy's character from this. Okay, so, how much? It's, a hundred, it's 120 feet, right? Uh, let me check. Like oh, well, that's, it's that's, that's longer than what I have. It's pretty ridiculous. Uh, it should be Twilight Blessing. I think. No. Did I not put it on my uh, character sheet? Uh, apparently you didn't. I thought I did. Well, time to find the site. <laughs> <clears throat> Make sure. 
because that was something stupid and just broke the scariness of caves. <laughs> there is no <laughs> scariness of caves anymore. Right? Uh, no. Uh, you have a dark vision out to a range of 300 feet. And you can share the dark vision of this feature with willing creatures that can see 10 feet of you. That you can see within 10 feet of you. You can give yeah. up to... Uh, uh, it lasts for an hour. You can give up to yes. a modifier amount of people the same dark vision you have. Yes. Which is and it lasts for an hour. <laughs> so, uh, you can give that to both Mud Puppy and Squall. Squall only has, I think, 60 feet, right? I think it's 60. <laughs> yeah. So, I will oh, that's like... real quick for the next hour. Yeah. Yes. You have 300 dark vision. And Mud Puppy has 300 dark vision. Alright, who, yes. who wants to lead That's the balance? Yeah, perfectly balanced. Neither of you really make a difference, but you do now see yeah. into the cave. I guess I'll lead since I can also see in the dark. See. And they'll benefit from me being the leader. Alright, see. That sounds good to me. What do you think? What do you think, mister? Anyways, to the path with no light. Well, <laughs> Although that should not be an issue. You could uh, change your icon with the chat. Oh, sorry. Cave slowly gets yeah. bigger as you guys go through. It's big enough for you guys to easily fit through. And as you go in further, you see what looks more like a statue. This dragon is, is encased about mostly in stone. From the lower back down and most of their face and claws. They're not moving. Mm. It's like, huh. What do I roll to see if I can go away? Ew. If I'm it's like if I have a vague recognition of who this person is. Uh, you wouldn't know. Yeah. So, hmm, I, I wonder if anything happens if we touch it. Do we touch the stone? Do we touch the stone? You can touch the touch stone. The st <laughs> We're gonna touch the statue. It's like, it's I'm touch. gonna... <laughs> I'll touch the stone. <laughs> okay. Uh, you walk up to what, as you touch the stone parts of its body, you hear a grunt, and the head slowly rises from the floor and turns back to look at you. Well... So, At least we know it's alive, so, I guess. Oh, so, <laughs> and it speaks more visitors. Uh, yeah. Was this the ghost we were trying to look, or? Oh. It's like. <laughs> I guess that means me. It's like, oh, you're the, oh, you're the ghost, the supposed ghost that my sister's been talking That's about. You dragonettes have been calling me. Yeah. 
Though I am very interested in how you look, how you look more like stone. Do you? May I ask what happened, or is that a little too personal? Well, he thinks about it for a moment. Uh, it doesn't matter. I am an animus dragon. Ooh. I don't think changed or better yet I made it so every time I cast a spell more of me would become stone I see instead of losing my soul oh that sounds pretty noble <laughs> could have been worse yeah I don't think we have Amish dragons in our I don't think I've ever heard of the term Animus Dragon in my kingdom. You did. Rosary has it. Yeah. yeah. Well, we don't yeah. have any Animus Mudwings. There are none. No. Yeah. Hey. What was that? Hey. I, I was just <laughs> going to say, I'm pretty sure I have not heard of any of those dragons before. But yeah. then I can have enough from here. It's like, so. Oh, I say I've never seen a dragon like you before. Let's see. She's. Yeah. This is Rose. Yeah. She's from a different area. She's from a different place. I can see that. And I think that's behind you too. Oh, it's like, sorry, it's behind. His name is like, would you like to introduce yourself? Uh, uh, I'm Squall. Hmm. I am Stone Mover. Funnily enough. And you too? I'm a. But puppy, formerly the big wings, formerly of the big wings army, mud kingdom, mud wing kingdom. And I'm Rosary, and as you can see, I am not from this place, but I'm more of a healer. Oh. <clears throat> he looks at uh, between you three. Mm hmm. <clears throat> Well, I don't get a lot of visitors around here. Nobody really bothers me. Yeah. Is, do you miss people? Do you miss people, or are you kind of oh, I this, a little annoyed when people come to you? I'm, I I enjoy conversation. It's just today I don't know. It's just. Is something bothering you? No, just thinking. Yeah. Uh, take all of the time you need then. Uh, a Nightwing came earlier today. Just asking questions, but I haven't seen my daughter yet today. She must be busy. Maybe. Yeah. Knowing how the schools are, yeah. She's running the place. You know, Sonny. Think... Sonny? Is she, is she who I... Do I know? It's like... Yeah, you know her. She is. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we all know. Most of us know Dragon Disney. I haven't seen you yet, but... I'm so glad she's still alive. Wait. Yes, Squall. Okay. Uh, not that so the only way he can be moved is if someone grabs him or carries him. Uh, he's very heavy. Good luck with that. Yeah. So, but <laughs> you, you get the sense he purposely put himself here. Yeah. After 
the whole stone incident. The incident. The incident. I mean, it's basically. Would I have to roll a history check to know what it is? No. Oh. I mean. Actually, yes. Let me roll. Um, let me roll on disadvantage. Yeah, because it's a uh, because you're exhausted. Yeah, but you're you tired. Rolled pretty high. So, mud puppy, <laughs> you vaguely recall tunnels in the rainforest. A single tunnel that was used by night wings to. Well, it was made by the night wings to invade the rainforest. It's like, it's like, it's like, oh, yeah. You don't know where I it think went. about it. You don't know where it went. You don't know how it was made. We just know that it was they there. used it to invade. They used it to. Uh, they planned an invasion, but the rain wings instead invaded them through it. <laughs> because they never expected the rain wings to attack. They're the Spanish Inquisition. <laughs> that, that reminds me of those tunnels seen when I was at the rainforest some time ago. Yes, I mm. did make those. Oh. That's part of why I did this to myself. You feel was that a, a a did make or didn't make? He made them. He, he did make okay. the tunnels from wherever the night wings were from to the rainforest. Okay, which would you don't know? Uh, but as I said, <laughs> every time I cast a spell, I turn more into stone. So, when my body got too heavy, I put myself here. And, uh, right about now, something <laughs> runs or scurries in through over here. <laughs> uh, you can see it clearly. I need to find a thing real quick. Oh, were you all supposed to put some exhaustion level? I missed no, that just, if you it said... Was, it was just my puppy. That's okay. Uh, there's nothing for it. Okay. A uh, little... Fox hmm? comes in running through here and runs up to Stone Mover and drops oh. a little... What do you say? Uh, Just a pigeon. Right in front of him, and then scurries off down the exit tunnel. That is dinner. That. Oh, you have a little fox friend to give you some dinner? That's not. Oh. I enchanted him to bring me food when I just couldn't move anymore. That's easy. So. And he bends down to scoop up that pigeon into his mouth and then eat it. It's like, I'm assuming you regret making those tunnels. You can imagine. And... They told it... me to make them. They didn't have told me the attempt until after I made them. And once an animus object is already there, it takes more animus to get rid of it. My puppy goes silent, having remembered most, having remembered some horrible memories of war. At this moment, uh, you turn around and see Mighty Claws and Bayou just outside the cave. Mighty Claws can see you, Bayou can't. Hey! Or wait, can he? Dun dun dun! No, he can't hear. He can't see you. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> they do see the cave, though. They do see the cave. <laughs> and slowly begin to enter. Uh, but as they do, uh, you hear a loud dong three times. Dong. Which means... Class? Your next class is about to start. <laughs> yep. Wait, let's see, before we go... It's like... <sighs> Well, I think we might have to go if class is starting yeah, soon. And then these are turning around and going yeah. too late. I hope to see you again soon. Hope to see you again Thanks soon, Mr. Stonemover. You're welcome. You're welcome. I'll remember to keep this brought in mind. Mm-hmm. Come visit. We'll keep this between us. Yes. <laughs> All right, and we'll go back up. And back to school. Yep. In the main hall here. Uh Let me bring them out. A bunch of people are or a bunch of dragons are already waiting. Oh. Alright, where's the journal? And this guy laying over here is just on top of this pillar. Or this, not pillar, stalagmite. Yeah. Tsunami's just waiting for everyone to gather. As uh, Orpheus begins coming out, is he also not returned? Hmm. <laughs> and he he'll go over to Moonwatcher, and two of them start yavering on about something. Four frost. I do. I do believe Theo hasn't returned yet. Yeah. So I'll bring him out. Yeah. Everyone is here. Almost. We're still waiting on war frost. Yeah. Almost. You guys can uh, speak with everyone else while you're waiting for more frost to appear. Yep. Ah, yes. He's just internally, he internally doesn't know. Do I tell everyone about Stone Mover? Do I keep this secret between us? Oh. Okay. 
Well, do we really want to make everyone panic about a giant stone dragon in the bottom freaking yeah. den part of the cave? And it's like... Mm. A bunch of other dragons are going to start pouring out of these caves. Especially if it's an animus dragon. Mm. Mm. Okay, so Dio will return in a minute. Uh, yeah. That, well, he's not there. So. All right, get well soon, Mastro. Yeah, and uh, if anything, if anything comes up in no mic, let me know. If, yeah. All right. Because I'm doing two monitor things right now. I already got. Master's message. Okay, yeah. So. <clears throat> Tsunami has, is actually working the gong right now, which is stationed right here, up high on the wall. And she hits that thing twice, and that thing rings very loudly. Ah! <laughs> Just cat is like cute my puppy just yawning a little bit. <laughs> <sighs> and a mud wing, a little bit late, comes out from around the corner. Uh, finally. Almost a few bit longer than the last one. Another moment goes by, Tsunami hits the gong one more time and drops the mallet and flies down to the ground in front of everyone. Okay. Everyone <clears throat> ready? Yep. Yeah. I'm ready to celebrate being. <laughs> Alright. First things first. With what's been going around lately? Things are going to be a little dangerous. So, I hope you guys are good with weapons. I know you specifically are. Platinum winglet. So, I will trust you to find some food for us. As well, by yourself, without me. Pretty sure you can handle it. If you can handle a couple yeah. spiders. Mm -hmm. And I will stick with a jade winglet. And we'll split up in huts. When we're all done with that, we'll meet in the prey center. Alright, let's see. Sounds good. Ready? Hunting food. Maybe they can start piling some more food. So I can make some, so I can hone my cooking. Mm hmm. Hmm. Would they allow the use of spiritual weapons for this? <laughs> Summon the dead. Yeah. Yes, no. Yet. I mean, there's no reason why they wouldn't. Yeah. Fair. Just uh, try not to puree whatever we're going to kill. Try and bring it back in full. <laughs> or bring it back alive, if you can. As you know, All right. like, some of the students might want some things alive. Yeah. I I make no promises. If anyone wants to grab a net, me! I have brought several. She opens this big bag and throws them onto the ground. There are... <laughs> Uh, ten big nets that will, or large nets that can probably ensnare something smaller than a dragon. She splits them up five to five and hands out five to whoever will take one. My puppy takes one. I'll take one. <laughs> let's hope. Let's hope we get um, something good. Mud puppy rosary. Both take one. Or Orpheus. Does uh. One. 
Mm-hmm. I'll take one, I guess. And Powder will take one. And that leaves one more. I assume Horfrost might take one. Okay. So all of you have a large net. Yeah! We're gonna catch some food! Catch some food. And she then takes the other five and hands them out amongst the other party. The tiny little rain wing does not take one, of course. But uh, the ice wing winter takes one. Carne- uh, Kibley takes one. Mudwing takes one. The Skywing comes down, grabs one. And Tsunami keeps one for herself. Okay. I'll meet back in the prey center in as soon as you're done. All right. All right. All right. Let's go catch us some dinner. All right. And the group. All of them are going to go together. And they're gone. Flying out the front entrance of the Great Hall. Top ring. Let's hope he eats good tonight. <laughs> all right. So, assuming you all take flight as well. Yeah. Mm hmm. We move out to the main map. You won't go too far because. Obviously, you're going to want to find your main hunting ground somewhere around Jade Mountain. And there's a very blurry right now. It is very blurry right now. Yeah. Taking a while. Mm-hmm. Uh, Looks fine to me. <laughs> oh, there it is. Okay. On stream, it's very blurry. There it goes. I, I have so, a question. What is the scale of a mile? Uh, let's see. It's very small, big, but on the map it's a bit too big. Uh, you, there is a spot, or there's a giant forest laid out just in front of Jade Mountain. You're at the base of the mountain, or not really at the base. You're about two hundred feet up. Is where the entrance is. And before you is miles of forest and foresty hills. But is that on this side? You're on the left side, yes. Okay. So, really not going too far. It's too dense to spot things through the canopy up, though. That's... So, for the sake of that... Uh, how far out do you guys go? Let's say. In terms of miles? Yes. Or feet. In well, it says... Miles or feet. Yeah. Well, it says miles for map 4. So you don't like, have to go that far out. Yeah. There's probably something close by. Uh, 10 feet? <laughs> right, I don't ten. know how far that would be in miles. <laughs> 10 feet is 10 feet. You take two steps and you take 10 feet. <laughs> oh. Like, you take 10 steps and you take okay. Let's go. Um, 40 feet then. Okay, uh, you are now in the air, 40 feet away from the ledge. That's not very far at all. You can do that in one turn. <laughs> all right. <laughs> <laughs> Tess doesn't mind. have the map hasn't loaded okay. for me, so I'll have to refresh. <laughs> for the sake of this, roll 20. Uh, I want someone to roll a perception check. Anyone? 
Anyone? Oh, I, I, I wanna. Oh, Anyone? Uh, I can Anyone roll can. one. Anyone can. can we all? <laughs> well, Squall, Squall got a 25. Mm. I like perception. Fine. I see that. Roll one, anyways. I see. Yay. Uh, two plus two cannot plus two. see through the canopy of the forest. Oh. Okay. We'll go with that. No one else has to roll. Squall, as you guys are flying about, uh, let's say, 500 feet away from Jade Mountain's closest edge, you spot some movement through the uh, forest below and stop everybody. But after that, you can't see anything else. It's gone. Okay. Uh, I I thought I saw something. I don't see it anymore. That's everybody else. That's it. Yeah. Oh right. He's he's talking to you guys. Yes. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh, mm. oh my bad. I'm so sorry. Um, ah, uh, so, maps are being blurry. It's like, <laughs> yo, it's like, it's like, you can tell them to land because you're probably not going to get anything from the air. Oh, well, like, I think we should probably land. It's like, if you see something, you should probably land. Let's, yeah. You get right. tangled up by all these trees. Right. Oops. <laughs> With that said, you guys take to the fourth floor. And we shall change the map again. I made a forest. And you guys are at the top left of this, so if you can't find yourself. Yeah. I'm gonna move to the bottom here. We're at the top left. Okay. Yep, you're at the top left. Yeah. Oh yeah, I see. The trees automatically look like Uh yeah, they're tall. Yeah, they're so... tall as shit. Yeah, they're tall as shit. Uh, I believe that's mud puppies fishing, yeah. Yeah. Uh, right. So. Mud puppy, you see... Something step out from right here. Just ever so slightly. A deer. And it's bending its neck up, craning upwards to take a bite of some leaves. <laughs> I see. It's like, all right, for ourselves a good meal. What should we do? Then you see another one. Oh my god! What? How is like, all right, how should we approach this? We can't just. We could just throw the nets, but then that would mean they would struggle. And what if they break out? Powder's exceptionally good at hunting, yeah. so he'll be hiding behind this tree for now. Yeah. Taking a look, wondering hmm, what's the best way to go about this? Mm. Oh, Is this hi, where I take hi. a stealth check? In fact, if everyone wants to be stealthy, there yes. will be a group yes. self check. Yeah. Oh boy. I mean, yeah, this yeah that actually makes a lot of sense. Uh, we should probably stealthy so they won't they won't expect anything if we don't. I <laughs> have oh. disadvantage because I'm heavy armor. Oh. Yes, you do. <laughs> uh, you were saying uh, something. You like think a heavy armor. Uh, Think a heavy armor dragon would be stealthy? <laughs> roll two eights. 
You guys have a lot of he heavy armor. <laughs> yeah. We're all tanks. <laughs> we are the wall. Squall got the whole two successes for that natural 20. You can and do it. It is not dark, so Orpheus does not get a bonus. Orpheus for a 14. Powder? Powder gets 11. Now, let me make sure of something. Okay, so... Well, you are so good at hiding behind that tree. You have no idea. <laughs> that nothing knows you're there, basically. But sadly enough, almost every one of your teammates was not that great. Yeah. In hiding. Like... Uh, it comes down to Rosary and Horfrost both stepping on a branch, and the deer's Quickly look to your direction. They stand there, staring at you now. And then they hear something off to the left, and they're they're bolting. Oh, to their left or our left? Their left. Dang. So yeah, I will ask. It. Uh, well, their left as in he's facing. Uh, west on the map right now. Uh, this one. From behind the tree. He's facing west. He looks to you, and then something to his left spooks him. So, basically, straight south of you. Yeah. I'm gonna ask... So, to... I'm guessing it's <laughs> running to the right, then? Yeah, he's gonna go running right. Uh, oh, that's that's logical. Yeah. What were we rolling? For the sake of this, uh... wow, that passed. Uh... You know what? What's <gasps> everyone's? Let's what's that? What's everyone's dexterity? We don't need to roll initiative for this. Yeah. 13. 13. You got 13, 15. Uh, <laughs> Kate. Uh, Kate. Uh huh? Huh? Dex. Warfrost is 15. You got your dexterity? Yeah. Amber Wells is 15. And Powder is not amazing. Or is not amazing. Yeah, the deers are going first, okay? The deers are going first. They're going to, we're gonna we're gonna so, die to deer. Deers this... are extremely fast, by the way. Yeah. We're... As you see, this one is Usain bolting it to the right. But our arrow's faster. Yep. And that one is disappearing to the trees. And then more. Another one. Running this way. Another one. You see one just barely through the trees near the bottom. And then another. There's a lot of deers here. Oh There's my one God. over here that gets so spooked it slams its head into a tree and then stuns itself. Oh. Oh. Oh, shit. And then there's one deer over here. It's just gone. That one's just gone. He ran. He lives to tell the tale. So. What are you guys doing now? It's like. I want to see. But it's like. Uh, what's the system? turn order? Uh, just. We'll just go down the line. Uh. 
I'm going to start with Powder and Orpheus because they're not here. Uh, Powder sees them and is going to start dashing this way towards the one that just got stunned. Oh, and you can get one more. Orpheus doesn't have a net, so he'll just go here. Yeah. And we'll start with Horfrost. Uh, you can type up your what you're gonna do. My yeah. puppy, we'll start with you. Okay. Hey, John. I'm finally back. Oh, Welcome okay. back. Welcome back. Welcome back, you. Uh, you guys are hunting, and somebody spooked the deers that you guys have now are hunting. Oh no! And they're all running. <laughs> Amazing. Where am I? You're here. I don't have any vision. Oh, you're yep. dead. You got gored. <laughs> <laughs> uh, maybe reload the page. I don't know why you don't have vision. You should roll to have vision. Oh, apparently, no, he <laughs> doesn't have dark sight, so he doesn't get to see. Weird. I gave him vision. Okay. I don't know why that happened. <laughs> So it's ready? Yes. Okay. Okay. And I guess that means Cheesy's going. Yeah. Okay. Mm. So we'll, I'll take control of you. Yeah, thank you. At this point, there's less people here. No, no, no. We all just got back, so there's just two people still gone. It's all right. Uh. Mud puppy, you were doing? Oh, right. She just left. <laughs> I was about to say, I thought you were controlling right. now. Okay, Squall, yeah. what are you doing? That's a good question. Mud puppy, I, I'm catch up kind of you? wondering oh. what they saw to the left still. Oh right, I can. I need to add your soul defender. Since it was close to you over here. Well, if you want to do that, you can. Although, would I be able to like try to shoot one of them with my bow from here? Uh, I believe so. I mean, that's up to you. I mean, I guess I could do that. Maybe, like, the one I can... Like, could I shoot at the one I can sort of mostly see? Down... The, not the one that ran into a tree, the, uh... Oh, yeah. Uh, powder. The one over here, the one I had uh -huh. just running to, uh, spun around and instantly slammed its head into a tree and stunned itself. Amazing. <laughs> Oh, interesting. Is that mud puppy? Why am I chasing them? I have a crossbow. But can I, like, shoot this? You do. Oh, I didn't check. <laughs> uh, you can make an attack. Oh, well, no, you dashed. I mean, I had you dash. My bad. <laughs> okay. That was a bad idea. Oh, no. Ah! What did you do? I apparently had some spicy substance on my hand and I rubbed my eye. Oh. oh. No. Ow. Could have been worse. Camera will. Uh, you guys bad. can move. You guys can go ahead and freely move, by the way. Uh, it's on my sushi. Oh. Okay. Camera will, Rosary, and Squall, you guys can freely go ahead and move. Uh, that's a Camera will dash. No. Can no, I I've... still. Move them still back. use I my bow if I move. Click the wrong button. Uh, wanted... That one is in half cover if you shoot from there. Okay. I think I was like right here. So I move. Fifteen. Um. All 
Oh, that's not what I at all what I meant to click. Ignore that. Okay, yeah. Powder and mud puppy. Uh, mud puppy's not here again. <laughs> Do we have a turn order here? I had, we're not doing initiative. It's just your team and then the deers. Okay. Uh, since wanna... the deers were spooked, they ran. And we're just waiting on everybody to get associated real quick. Oh, that's within my range, I think. Yeah. If you have a bow. Yeah, I have a hand crossbow. Is this... Oh, let me... I think hand crossbow min range It is says two, right? 30 and max is 120. Okay, anything beyond the 30 has disadvantage. That's Got not you. Range. Is this still half cover? Uh, No, that is a straight shot. Yeah, it's... It, it ranges okay. 30 slash 120, okay, so any, I assume. Anything beyond the 30 has disadvantage. Got you. Yeah. And Squall, you have a longbow, right? Yes. Which is pretty damn long range, so you can take a shot if you yeah, want. Yeah, it's 150, 600. Mm. And this is at 120. All right. If you want to shoot, so do I just do I just click it in weapons? Yep. And which one are you shooting? Uh, I'm missing this one. Uh, I don't. Maybe. Let me make sure. You did in fact miss, and your arrow you lose. You think you have a good shot, but as it get, gets behind the tree, you hit the tree instead. So it's disc golf. All right, then I'm just going to dash to there. That's all I can do. All right. Um, uh, none of you can see what's over here. Is there a way to, like, use the ruler thing and then, like, once you've done, like, you can see what I'm doing, right? Yeah. Once you've done like this, just to like move yourself to it. Uh, if that's when you're you're holding left click on oh. your token and then doing right click while moving it. Yeah. So like, if I did this, how do I actually confirm the movement? You just let go. Oh wait, no. Uh, you need to be holding left click on your token, drag it around. While right clicking where you want it to go. Since. Uh, that doesn't. It didn't. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah. All right. As you guys are. Taking shot or taking one shot, rushing down the deers. Uh, suddenly, something spooks the deers again. And now, they're running the other way. <laughs> they're running back to us. Amazing. Uh, not back to you. The one that, this one up here, is stunned. It can't do anything this round. Uh, I'm assuming this way? Most of them are going to start running this way, indeed, yes. Yeah. Uh, I can get here. Hold on. Uh, it didn't do that. <laughs> it can go here. And then this one will Why are you running? <laughs> Why are you running? <laughs> Why are you gay? So, Where uh, are you going? Powder, you have a large net <laughs> that you can use to capture a live deer if you want to do that. That's why I moved you forward. I forgot to mention that. Uh... uh your I guess party, I want to do that. Yeah, your party has five large nets that can capture a live deer.
It is now your turn. Um, Party? Yeah, this one didn't move, did it? Yeah, it, it saw the thing and then one. Uh, I'm going to mention... Uh, no, no, never mind. Was Good. What's that? Nothing. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we'll start with powder. Yeah. What are you doing first? Um, I guess I'm going to dash in again. I can get to be like... Here, I think. I believe so. That would be turn then. Yep. Uh, Mud Puppy will. Actually, hold on. Not do that. Since she can see you going that way, or he will. He's going to start moving this way. You can go here. With one diagonal. Yep. And Orpheus will use. Let's see. No, he won't do that. I'll go here, 30 feet. And let me see. Uh, next will be. Uh, again, Horfrost, you can type up your response or go ahead and move. Squall, Camberwell, and Rosary, you guys can also move. Mm-hmm. Ah, I was stuck on Roller. How much range does this have? 90 feet. I dashed again. Okay. Okay, this is good. This is fine. Okay, if this goes here. Um, let me just, let me just move him there real quick just to check something. Because I don't know how to make the circle at a certain distance, so. Ugh. Well, I can get to like where I can see nothing. <laughs> Twenty feet. That hits everything. Okay. Uh, Orpheus <coughs> was up here. He's gonna cast sleep. Oh, is he gonna cast it on us deer. again? No, he's gonna hit. He's gonna be smart and use it on all those deer. Wow. All four of those. Well, then. Let me just make sure the aura turns off. Because I was just using it to check. Uh, Yeah, he'll do that at... Let's see. First level. All four deer. Collapse to the ground. All of them are asleep. Like, just while they're running, their legs just give out and they just fall. Did everyone move? It looked like they did. Yes. Yeah. I moved. Okay. With that said, it looks like uh, the deer powder is next to is going to bolt it this way. And all the other deer are asleep, so they can't do anything. Amazing. <laughs> oh, that's convenient. He does have sleep, so he's going to use it smartly. <laughs> or intelligently. 
Smartly is fine. Rationally. Rationally, yes. He's trying to catch stuff anyway. I was saying it was convenient, though, about the, the where it, it ran to. Oh, I literally just thought about that. Don't worry about it. I did not intentionally do that. <laughs> I yeah. forgot he had sleep. Did what? Oh, oh, Squall. Oh, you're going to shoot that one. Right? I was thinking about it, yeah. You can? That's That's what I was saying was convenient. Well, it was stuck between powder or a tree, so. Yeah. At least it's soft powder coming. Well, if you want to take a shot, go ahead. Yeah, I can lose another arrow. You can lose another. The arrow you shot is still sticking out of that tree. That one hits roll yeah. damage. Uh, I click the, the name on the thing, yes, right? You click the long bow at the chat. You lose that arrow, and as it's running from, like, you, you, you track it from here, and then you fire the arrow perfectly and strike it straight in its uh, side of its body, and it just goes limp right there and falls over. Yay. Yay! Murder! That one's dead. They don't really have a lot of HP. They're deers. Wait, how many deers? Are there roughly? Uh, five. <laughs> five deers. All oh, right. Nice. Uh, one got away. And I'm gonna move. Actually, where was I? I'm gonna move down a bit. Okay. As soon as I. Oops. As let's see. Uh, who can see that? I don't think anyone can see that. Uh Powder, what's your passive perception? Mine? Uh... 14. Do I see something? I am rolling for it. You do not. You see that? You did. But there's nothing there. Well, uh, that basically ends the deer hunt. So you guys can go collect your deer. They're asleep for how long? A minute or something? But what were they running from? This one's asleep forever. Yeah. And like I assume we don't we don't see anything like around that they were running from. Obviously. Uh, like if see. if I looked over like this way. You can make a perception check. Oops. Oh, wait, no, that's good. Oops. Oh, never mind. Uh, Squall, you do see something. Yeah, it's called a tree. It's right in front of my face. <laughs> no, you... Uh, from the tree behind it, you see something run off. It looked like... some sort of hound creature. But you didn't get a whole lot on it. You just saw it run off into the shadows of some uh, some other trees. Okay.
You guys can go ahead and go to your deer. Let's go collect some deer. Also, I see a red scribble on the map. Is that where one of the deer was? Yeah, that's where or... the deer, deer was. Oh, uh, right. Where Frost has a net, right? Yep. Where Frost has a net he can use. Powder has a net he can use. Uh, Mud Puppy took one and Rosary took one. So Mud yes. Puppy... My puppy is gonna come down here, and I believe her passive perception's a lot higher than Powder's, <laughs> or his. I keep saying hers. Okay, never mind. It's not. <laughs> uh. I will say, Squall, while you're going over to the deer, your earlier roll, since you're looking out for things, I am assuming you're going to keep looking for it with that roll. Yeah. This tree here. Something's there. Something? Something. Something there. <laughs> Something there. <laughs> you saw... Is this a type of something I can, like, recognize more than a thing? Uh, all you see is a furred hand go back behind the, tr behind the tree. It's trying to hide from you. Hmm. Like, a furred paw, not a hand. All right, Mud Puppy is netting this one while you're sitting there looking at that. Oh, at this vision either. Oh wait, no, that's the thing. Never mind. Where is it? Uh, here it is. Netted. Uh, or Frost netted this one by the looks of things. <laughs> Hmm? <laughs> the, the no mic chat. So there's one, two, three, four. I'm going to presume, Powder, you're going to go get it or hold on to this deer? Yes. Okay. You can well, did someone have a... Carry it. We'll just say you use your net on it because there's no other... If you if you don't want to, well, there's the one down here. Yeah, there's. I four. mean, you don't need to use a net on a dead deer. Yeah. Uh, Rosary, Kate. Mm -hmm. I'm Sorry. Assuming, yeah, I'm assuming you're gonna go ahead and um, move down and net one of the other deer. And am I free to move yeah. or? Yeah, you can. This is not doing anything right now. You're just getting your deer. All right. I am netting and this deer. Skull has the other net, but he saw something and he stopped. Yeah. And I believe sleep only lasts a minute. In the sake of this, uh, we'll say it's been 30 seconds since the deer fell asleep. Here, here's a net. <laughs> By the time uh, Squall saw that 30 seconds had passed. Get the deers in the nets. Providing net. Uh, how how much is well? I have provided net. Provided okay. net. Okay. We'll just say all these deer are netted. Yes. Yes. All can the deer I, got can netted. I, can I do a stealth that isn't group? You can if you're gonna try and sneak up on whatever's hiding from you. You didn't mention it. Yet, yeah. So everyone's just gonna be like, "What are you doing?" I'm failing miserably. You are failing miserably. That is a man. Uh, you step closer to that tree, 
you take one step and <laughs> the forces of Well, nature... why doesn't everyone else running back th why doesn't anyone else want running through here cause something to happen when I take one step? I don't know. You you tried the stealth. I mean, but you still rolled a natural one. You're trying to move around. Uh, which way are you trying to move around, let's say? Uh, no like this? Under. Can can you see it right now? Or is this not show? It, it's not showing yet. <coughs> okay, so you're going to try and go around the left side. Whatever this creature <coughs> is, once you come close to it, I'm going to make it visible now. It drops whatever it was doing. It jumps off the tree. Everyone can uh, see and hear it now. Fantastic. Oh, that's convenient. And this odd-looking creature is... If you think of it like a panther with long tendril-like tails with spikes on it. Ah. Of course. H however... Squall, your perception is as it's jumping and running away, you can see some pretty hefty bite wounds on it, and it's just running. It looks wounded, it's limping. It was just trying to get a deer. You okay. Just, it's massive. Yeah. You could. You don't. You could go after it. I would kind of like to. Everyone else? This giant panther-like thing? Oh, well, panther meat's not that great. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna, just gonna... Is it too big for the net? It's much bigger. Way oh. too big for a net. I'm gonna back off the here. All is, uh, uh, does Orpheus have more sleeping? <laughs> he does. And he is. Well, he was in range. But it ran off the map. Unless you chase it. I mean, I'd, I'd like to chase it. This sounds like a dumb idea. Seems like something guessed. Orpheus would enjoy doing, too. What was that, Powder? I advise against. Okay, Powder says no chase. Anyone else? I don't want to chase. Frank, come back. Okay, Welcome back. Okay. All right. Uh, in that case. Did we get some deer meat? You got deer meat. Uh, you also saw a giant panther-like creature with massive tendril tails with what looked to be teeth on it run away over here. Oh. Where'd it go? It vanished into the darkness. Yep, it did. So, well, did you say it looked like it was wounded? It was very heavily wounded. It was limping yeah. and running away. What? Is it gone now? You can well, still see I, it I running away. Kind of wanna ch I kind of want to. I kind of want to chase it, but apparently no one else does. Okay, I say. I mean. <clears throat> I mean, I'm down to chase it. See what the hell it is. There is no Yay. challenge in such a, such a prize. It's not a prize. It's not a prize, but it is very interesting to see. Yeah, it is dying. Squall's going There's after no it. Zoop, zoop. Zoop, 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 I'm going. Where'd it go? Okay. So you can grab the deer if you want, Mud Puppy. Yeah. It is netted. You can haul it over. 
They're uh, compared to you, they're pretty small. Okay, let me hold. Uh, let me hold this deer and take oh. it with you. Yeah. You're... Okay, you're taking the deer with you. Uh, you will. You're you're big, and it's not that big, but with no your strength, with your strength, there is yeah. you will be moving at half speed. Okay. Okay, let me go two. All right. Anyone else grabbing a deer? I have this deer. Okay. You have I have. I have a bottom deer. <laughs> oh, you have a deer. Okay. You, a deer near the bottom. Deer. Bottom of the map. <laughs> uh, powder. Your strength no. is high enough to not be encumbered. Uh huh. Rosaries is not. So if you carry a deer, you will be encumbered and move at half speed. Uh, Horse Frost, are you going to carry one? Alright, let's check this. Uh, whoever's carrying a deer, put a deer in their inventory. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. All right, I guess time to, care, time to carry a deer. Okay. So, the creature that... Okay, for the sake of this, I believe Horfrost is taking a deer. Uh, All right, where is the... Yet, though. Yeah. Uh, Orpheus joins is it... call. Camberwell, you here? Yeah. Okay. Uh, everyone's taking off towards the wounded beast, so. Uh, uh, do I just add in equipment? Uh, your items, I guess so, yeah. Just so I don't have to keep them on the map. <laughs> dear! It's like, dear! That should be. Okay. Alright, uh, got dear. All right, I'm going to move to the main map and readjust this one. I guess I'm going to follow to make sure no one gets hurt. Okay. Thank you. So we have one dead deer and four captured ones. That's a... What the fuck is that? What? Uh, you hear that thing behind my voice? Oh. No. Uh, I do. It, I think it was a plane. A plane? Oh. Uh-huh. Okay. It's flying low. low I still low. hear it. The low rumble. Far in the distance. Fun. Okay, so... With everyone chasing uh, this wounded creature... Let's see... It's not very good at getting away. So, for the sake of that, we won't roll for this. <laughs> and we'll move on to... Why is Rosary small? What's going on here? Oh. We'll go back to the map in just a moment. I need to bring it out. Okay. And now I would like everybody to roll initiative. Oh. This is where you have to click on your, your token first and then roll it, right? Uh -huh. Yes. Roll oh, what initiative. I need to do disadvantage. No, not for you. Oh. Uh no, if you're carrying a deer it doesn't do anything to your initiative. Oh. Shouldn't I be, like, out in front a bit? You did take first, so yes. My bad. I was just getting everyone together. 
And okay. go ahead and rearrange yourselves where you would like. Uh, no one, be, no one beyond Squall. Okay, is that everyone? <coughs> I need two, four, three. One second. Okay. And then we'll do that. And Oh. Okay. And with that, oh, we're, we're going to do this in descending. Is that everybody in the row? Yeah. Okay. Camera well. You're first. Me. All right. Oh, boy. And Rosary is next. So if you're next, yep. think about what you're doing. We're going to speed this up. All right. First I'll try to. Out. What are you doing, Camberwell? I'm gonna use um. I'm gonna use cure wounds on myself. That's all right. If you want. A uh, level one. Yeah. That's eight That's health, right? Yeah. You heal for eight hit points. You can move. And you also have Bardic Inspiration, but that's your bonus action. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna go ahead and give Rosary a Bardic Inspiration. Oh, thanks. Rosary is inspired. Right. <laughs> that's all I'm doing. For once. <laughs> all right, and we're going... Rosary, you're next. I okay, am gonna next. move. I am gonna move a little to see if I can see anything. Okay. My puppy, you're after Rosary. Okay. I'll move up to here. And once my character sheet loads, I am gonna cast. Oh, not yet. This one? I don't know. I am going to cast Fairy Fire to see if there's anything kind of close or distant enough. Are you going to cast it on the beast ahead? Oh, there's a beast ahead? <laughs> Do you not see it? Oh, you're behind the tree. It's kind of just ran behind a tree. Yeah, you just ran oh. behind a tree. Uh, you can't see it anymore. You were chasing something. Oh. It's. it's well, uh, can I? <laughs> you you saw it. If you were here, you would see it. Uh, if you move like ten feet up, <laughs> or five. So feet up. ten. So like on polar frost? No, not hard frost powder. powder. <laughs> yeah. I moved up. There, I could see you, it. You saw it when coming down to that tree, since you were just above him. So you would have seen it here. You know where it's at. If you saw that mark. I didn't even see the mark. Okay, you see it now. Yes. Uh, nope. Nothing came up, unless it's like. Away from out. where my token is. Uh, All right, try again. What's going on here? Are you like really zoomed in or something? 
No, I'm at 70%, so I should be able to see it. You should be able to. Uh, 70% might not be enough. I don't know. It's right there. Oh, if you made the thing moving, then yeah, I can see that now. Yeah, that's what you're chasing. Was that not clear? No, sorry. I'm just tired. That's all right. So I've been zoning in and out. But I'll... Wait, how far am I? How far can I go? You're 75 feet away from it. Now everyone can see this thing is very heavy. Well, I'm well. I'm gonna move up to the bottom of the tree or the root. Okay. That is, and that's my turn. You haven't. You can do something. You have. You bought a hand. Oh. Pistol, didn't you? Pardon? You didn't move that far. No, I didn't. Yeah, you have. Uh, but can I shoot it? You have spells. Is it have... possible to shoot? From here, yes. What does the Bardic Inspiration do? Uh, Bardic Inspiration. Gives you an extra life roll. It gives you an extra 1d4, right? Yours right now, currently? Mm -hmm. to I believe so. Anything uh, you choose, like attack roll, ability roll, or I think a saving throw, right? Maybe not. I Maybe believe not so. Maybe. I'm also gonna cast spiritual weapon to prepare it. Okay, you have the spiritual weapon. You can put that on top of it. I'll put that on top of the thing we're chasing. Okay. <laughs> Since I can literally send it forward that far. <laughs> Well. Oh, yeah, okay. We'll make this your token for your spiritual weapon. I have yes. still forgotten to make it. But yes. Here it is. This is your It's fine. Token. I'm... It's fine. It'll do. It's a weapon. <laughs> yes. It's not a dead spider this time. <laughs> not a dead goat. The last time it was a goat. Oh, it was a goat, right. It's not a random goat. <laughs> yeah. I will give that control to you. I just need to, in a moment, uh, go ahead and make your attack because you can strike it. All right. Give me a moment. <laughs> uh, just click on spiritual weapon. You already did the, the attack is 25. Oh, cast a level two. That is the minimum. Eleven force damage. It's running forward. You summon your spiritual weapon, the the viney mace, and just bash its head as it's running away. You still have an action. I uh can I move more as my other action? Or uh, yes, you can dash. All right, I'll dash to, I'll just ping, to here, if you saw that green ping. Uh, do it again. Which I admit is bad, uh, color. It's all right. E. I can see it. <laughs> okay, uh, mud puppy. E, and that'll end my turn. 
Mud Puppy, you're not next, actually. Oh, uh, okay. Mud? In fact, Mud Puppy, uh, something catches your attention. Oh. Oh? Let me pull this out. Oh, God, no. Yeah. A, cre a familiar looking creature to you was running this way. And it's quarry. I heard R2D2. Is the beast you guys are chasing as it expels a large cone of fire trying to blast it. Does this look to be about the same sort of size, shape, movement as the thing that I saw south of us in the previous area? Yes. Okay. And, oh, wow. Uh, this displeasure I'll beast... be right back. Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, the beast roars in... Pain. I need to actually make a save on it. Uh, it does not make the save. The beast sc screams out in pain as it takes a very hefty amount of fire damage. Is it dead? It's not dead yet. But now it is your turn, Mud Puppy. And speaking of, oh, no, no, puppy, you no, see no. that creature. I need you to make a wisdom saving throw. If I remember, okay. Oh no. The fear engulfs you for a minute. You stand there staring at it, but you shake it off. <laughs> oh god, I'm not this again. But. It's now your it's turn. Over. Yeah. And Powder, you're next. Alright. Alright. After my Okay. And Okay. Alright, this should be Rosary. I can oh I don't need to put that in your journal. Okay. Well, you should be able to control the sword now. Alright. Try moving it around. Uh, I cannot click on it. Cannot click on it. Got it. Uh, I shall, cannot I shall here. click. Okay. Let me... Alright, you moving puppies? Moving down there? Mm -hmm. Just to get a closer look at this bean. At the thing that breathes. Embrace fire and like, ask. Ah, I do think I don't have any range weapons. Do I do this? Earth trimmer? Right. It should be okay. Let me do this. Can I try moving it now. Let's see. Nope. Still don't. Still can't. Strange. Why is this sword not wanting to be moved? I can ping on it, but I cannot click on it. Hmm. Um, I was about to do something stupid. Didn't I realize that would mean we lose our food? <laughs> We're gonna throw a deer at it and beat the shit out of it with a deer. <laughs> <laughs> you actually gonna do that? No, that's what I thought, but no, that's my food. Ah, oh, man, I got to cook that shit. <laughs> it's still alive. Your deer is still alive. It, it's and still they, alive. So it, I could get cooked if you throw it at it. They're still asleep. <laughs> it's only been 50 seconds. Yeah. The next round, you wake oh. up. 
<laughs> oh no. Anything? Are you doing I anything think that, that puppy, or is that your turn? I swear to Okay. <laughs> Take Powder is up. I clicked it twice by accident, but it's your turn. Okay. Hey. <laughs> um. No, I said I'm K. Okay. 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 <laughs> I'm gonna um, fly about. Okay. Uh. Oh, fuck! I didn't mention it. I only mentioned it to Orpheus and Mud Puppy, didn't I? Flying through thick forests will. Uh. In impede a uh, difficult terrain on flying. Well, how high up is the canopy? It's high enough that it's not difficult terrain here right now, so don't worry about it. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Also, <laughs> the same on the same subject, this doesn't look like a very thick forest. Yeah, I know. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just mentioning it. If anyone wants to All right, cool, thanks. note that somewhere. Because uh, Mud Puppy and Orpheus had to do it. Yeah. Anyway, um, that'll be all I do for now. Okay. Oh, uh, Horfrost, you can think about your turn as the beast that is trying to run goes this way around the tree, and let me make sure it's move speed. Okay. Oh. My bad. Uh, good thing I noticed that. Uh, this is actually... Okay. <clears throat> okay. Uh, Horfrost. Squall, you're next. The silent killer. Horfrost, the ice wing. Yes. Stalks forward, along with Mistletane. Double dash. Okay, that will be his turn. Which means, Squall, it is your turn. Yeah. Okay, good an angle. Oh, you're going for the big beast. I'm going for strategic positioning. <laughs> All right. Okay. Did you dash? No, that was 30. Oh, okay. You can shoot. Turn that on. Is this technically partial cover? Yeah, that's partial cover, so it'll have a plus two to AC. Well, I mean, for the moment, it's chasing this, we think. Yeah. But now that it's if I here, shoot at it, if I shoot at it, it's more likely to go after us, maybe. What do you think? 
You gonna shoot? At I think I'm. I'm gonna shoot at this. All right. Make your shot. That's a miss. That is indeed a miss. Your shot. You're you're looking back and forth between the two, and you let loose at the bigger beast, and you just go wide. Oop. You did not actually go back for your last arrow, so you are down a couple shots. I am indeed. Uh. That arrow. Look, I think there's out. one still sticking out of someone's deer. Uh, I don't. You missed a deer, so that was the one you hit the tree with. Oh wait, no. Then yeah. No. Uh, there's there's probably pounds. still an uh, arrow I can recover from a deer. Yeah, powders. Uh, we'll, we'll worry about that in a minute. Anyway, yeah. that was your turn, and you wild missed. Uh, it is Orpheus's turn. He will get an angle. He hasn't seen the hound yet, so Nether's can't. He'll put well. us all to sleep. Uh let's see, he goes here. Can he get an angle? How far is that? Hundred feet. That's not in range. That's not in range. Oh, he can see it now. Yeah, that's in range. <clears throat> okay. He is going to try casting Crown of Madness. <coughs> and he must make a wisdom saving throw. He's gonna cast it on the new creature that just showed up. And, uh, Camberwell, you are next, so think about what you're going to mm -hmm. do. And the hell are you making a wisdom save? What is that roll? No. Uh, Camberwell, you watch Orpheus. This, uh, energy pour out from him, and suddenly, whoever can see that new creature a sort of metal crown just appears above its head. And it seems to have lost all interest in you. Camberwell, is now your turn. Um... Rosary, you're next. Oh, boy. And I cannot still move my weapon, but that's okay. That's, I will move it. That's the monster, <laughs> right? That is Horfrost Steel Mistletane. The new monster that uh, uh, Orpheus just did. Yeah, it's done there. That's okay, it. that's what I thought. You didn't yeah, see that's that, just what... though, so you just see the crown on its head. Yeah, I, I just see a monster, and that's all I can do for my turn, really. So You can still attack, though. You have a bow. Or, well, you have a can crossbow, but... You have yeah, it's not going to read... Ah, uh, no, I'm good. That's all, all I'll do for right. my turn. I moved there. All right, Rosary, your turn. Mud puppy, think about what you're gonna do. I am gonna move here, and because I cannot click on my weapon, uh, uh can the weapon go on top of the enemy? If enemy? it's in, the... I can mouse can you ping the hound? The hound. The very angry hound. It is a very angry hound. It is it is what breathes fire just now, so Alright. Spirit's weapon, go. Okay. Uh, you attack the hound with a crown on its head now. And I do believe 
<laughs> That's a lot of damage. Uh, That's a lot of damage. In fact, Why can't my normal weapons do this? <laughs> <laughs> because you, the the vine mace, once again spins around and just gives it one big wallop across the face, and it <laughs> makes that. First in peace, doggo. <laughs> it's like, final, it's like, I'm gonna make a dash on my next turn. And let me make sure. Uh. And that is all I'll do. I just wanted to yes. give it a wallop. <laughs> it, it is now the hound's turn. Which it's probably angry. Orpheus. Well, now that Orpheus has it breathe fire again, uh, it needs to make a check for that. Saving throw? No. Oh. A uh, wisdom it check? It does recharge, though. Uh, but it can't do that because it has the jagged crown above its head. Instead, uh,. Orpheus can just command it to and it attack the spiritual weapon. It cannot. It will. The only thing well, then, like he do, can't do anything with it. It can run this way, but he can't do it. So. Actually, it, it'll just take his turn as normal, right? Yes, it cannot reach the beast. So, it either goes this way, which I do well, actually. Since it seems to have competition for its food now, it will go up here and breathe more fire. More fire. Which direction? At the creature it's trying to kill. It's trying to get it. Well, that's good. Yeah. Uh, I need to manually roll it. <laughs> oh my god. What? Uh, well, that's a lot of damage, but the beast seems pretty resilient and dodges most of the fire, but its legs get all caught up in the fire and just it yelps and pushes itself away. Uh, that is... Okay. It can is I dash? Mud Puppy's turn. Can I dash? You can dash. How many... It's like, how many... What's the maximum feet I can dash? Oh, 30 feet, so I can... 30 feet is your normal 30. movement, so... Yeah. That, so well, dash and go... Encumbered by a deer. Oh, yeah. yeah. 15, so 30 stubble. And Rosary, you also have a deer, I just remembered, so... Yes, I remember. I have a deer. Which is slowing you down by half speed. I have a deer that is not feared. <laughs> uh, in fact, now, whoever has a deer... The deers are awake in the nets now. I was Had going to say, I don't think they'd be asleep. <laughs> well, they uh, were asleep, now they're awake. Uh, Powder is the only one that's dead. Uh, Mud Puppy, for... Yes. At the start of your turn, Mud Puppy, make a strength check. Okay. Just to hold on to the I deer. Have, I have the only the deer. No! It's not a save, it's a check. And oh shit! No disadvantage. Oh uh, wait. Because uh, this is not check. a ability check. This is a normal check. Okay. So you don't have this advantage. Thirteen. Yeah, you're fine. You're holding that deer. I'm holding that deer. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna. All right. Let me go thirty feet. I guess. Wait a minute. And you can use two you're diagonals because you're dashing. The yeah. Yeah, I think? She's, yeah, if you're dashing, you can do two diagonals, but that's it. So, so that, so, so I could do this? You can, you can do... 
Yeah. Yeah, you can there do that. That's, that's it. That's all you can do. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. All right, that's my turn. I. Uh, you could go oh, one up from there. Yeah. There we go. Thank you. Thank mm-hmm. you. It is now Powder's turn. Yeah. Well. Uh. We're just gonna. I'm just gonna zip zoom around here. Zippity zoom. All right. That means it's this creature's turn. I'm gonna actually. Oh. Do this as well. There we go. Oh. Okay. Well. It's, uh, this one's going to dash. Well, no, it won't. Yeah, it's just going to run this way. <clears throat> After getting caught on fire again. Uh, Fort Frost said he's going to dash northwest. I think he means northeast, so... Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go with that. Northwest. Weast. Oh, you meant weast. Uh, he is carrying a deer, so he's going to go here, but his missile tank gets more in move speed, I believe. <clears throat> uh, Yeah, actually, it gets 40 feet, so it can go there. And I think he wants to keep it closer to himself, though, so... Yeah, I think he was saying, like, 15 feet away, so that's probably about as far... Right here. Okay, Squall, your turn. Yeah. Well, shooting it has been going so well. What am I... That's the wrong one. In Crown of Madness, it gets to save on the beat start of its turn, right? Or at the end of its turn. Uh, end of its turn. Okay, let me do another wisdom save for it. Nope, it did not get free. <laughs> and you were doing what? And I'm I'm gonna try to shoot the the big thing again. Okay, the big beast, shoot it. Ah, uh, it's another miss. <laughs> oh, you poor soul. Okay. Uh. Well, and just going swimming. Why are you running? Why are, you Why are you running? Well. Why are you gay? So. <laughs> mud puppy. Huh? You're not looking this way, so. Uh, last time you saw one of these, it wasn't alone. And now you know this one's not either. This one just came out from the bottom. So, that's its move. And action. So, it's now Orpheus' turn. Fear. Does he have to use the turn to maintain Friend of Madness? Uh, it is concentration, so he is concentrating. I need to bring up his character sheet again. Uh... And now would be a great time for whoever that is to start trying to talk to him again and break his concentration, right? Orpheus? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> well, he's got this one controlled. Or charmed. Yeah. Um. Not now! And sleep is not a concentration spell either, so. 
they just fall asleep. Um, he's gonna move here. This is concentration. He's not gonna. Do I mean, that. he can see the other one, right? He... No, he does not Barely. have a line of sight on this one. It's behind a tree. Mud puppy. Well, it. I mean, I can see its icon. I don't know yeah. if that means from his point of view. I guess just... I guess his point of view it's just barely a scrape of it, so he probably didn't notice it yet. You were the only one. Powder can see it. You two are the only ones that can see the second one. I probably haven't noticed it yet because I was shooting at the big thing off to the left. Your passive perception's high enough. You would glance over. Oh, there's another one. Back to the beast. Okay, <laughs> another it. one. And... <laughs> How far is it now? Uh, he's just gonna move up to here. He's dashing. Okay, next up is Camp Whale and then Rosary. Camp Whale, the best, best other Another character. dash. <laughs> Fast as fuck, boy. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> I swear, we're gonna need to bust out the initial D music. Yes. <laughs> I want that spiritual weapon to stab the hound again who keeps running away. <laughs> okay, it can move that close. And then. My and then he screams at the house. <laughs> 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 yeah, die, right. monster! <laughs> die, monster! You don't belong no, in this world. Does <laughs> <laughs> oh, that hit? Ah, oh, shit. Will this be another eleven? Nope. No, but that's still good damage. <laughs> that doggo is. Howling in pain. Well, uh, did you move? I moved as well. Yes. You do still have an action. I think you have a hand crossbow. Oh yeah, I do. But can I attack it from here? Yes, you can. That is less than thirty feet. Yay! Uh Time for this to not work because my crossbow aim is horrible. <laughs> You're right. I called it. <laughs> Blue an arrow from your. That's a light crossbow. That's not a hand crossbow. Oh, oops, wrong crossbow. It's all right. Either way, you shoot just over its head, and it sticks into the tree beyond it. It is now that doggo's turn. Uh, the it, angry the, doggo it probably wants anything. us all dead. It is getting very mad at you. And it, it angry. will not breathe fire on you. It is going to rush up to you. And it's going to bite at you. But you just... <laughs> you move your claw up and you just smack its face away from you. <laughs> There's a big it wings. Does not Do I dare? You. Never mind. Mud puppy, like, it is now your turn. Powder, you're next. It's like, I was about to say, like, Harry, how many, how many squares is that? Son of a bitch. <laughs> Son, of a Son, bitch. Of a, Son of a bitch. I'm going to have to dash again with, the, with a weapon in hand. You don't have to dash. Yeah. She does. She has a deer. A deer. She's holding a deer. She's not strong oh. enough to move fully. Throw the deer. I was like, all right. <laughs> Who, or who wants to be the one to protect the deer while I go? Spawn, go show the dog. You, you just have the uh, net basically tied to you. Yeah, it's like shit. Powder's it's the like, one who has to one hand hold the deer, one hand to wield a weapon. Yeah. If he even has a one handed weapon. I do, they're all one handed weapons. Okay. God, is a, I see. I don't have any. I don't have any strictly two-handed weapons on me. 
Okay. I have a Warhammer, and I'm using that one handed. Might as well use that one handed. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead and yeah. get close because I mean you have spells. Yeah, I could use like I could use Earth Tremor, but that's ten feet, and that's not close enough. <laughs> that will literally not help anyone. Oh yeah, it's a range of ten feet. Sure? It's ten feet. That will not help anyone anymore. Oh yeah, it's the oh, it's the ground around. Isn't it. that basically yeah. melee? Uh, I think I can dash and then activate Shield of Faith. I think. Or you can if you're if you're talking yeah. about Shield of Faith, you can. Yeah. All right. I bet. You also have a uh, divine favor. That's also a bonus action. Yeah. You have two bonus actions, both of which are concentration yeah. spells. Yes. This is fine. It's like, all right, I'm going to activate. Thy, I'm going to activate thine divine favor, so I can smite the demon. Okay. I just... Whenever you go on something. demon. You yep. deal an extra 1d4 radiant damage on hit. Yep. That ends your turn. Powder. Uh. You can just narrowly see the second beast coming around that corner. Is that true? You mean here? <laughs> you going for it? <laughs> Getting yes. this! I'm 20 feet up in the air. Okay. I'm gonna hover over here. Okay, you're 20 feet up. Uh, or did you add that to your green? Okay, you did. Okay, this beast is starting to get away. Leaving so soon? Hold on. It, nope, hold on. It is... This, 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 this. Okay, it is going up here. It is 20 feet off the map right now, but I'm just putting it here. It's because Squall can still shoot it. Okay. If he's still going for it. Uh, Horfrost! <laughs> and then Squall again. Okay. Uh, north or towards the new opponents, because... That thing's so far away, and you probably won't be able to catch it. I'm gonna... S I'm gonna guess you mean this way. <laughs> I'm gonna move him straight east. If he if you say anything, let me know. Squall, it's your turn. Yeah. yeah. Can I still see it from here? Yes, you can. Uh, at the angle you have now, it would have partial cover, but you can see um, out because of this tree. Yeah. It's 20 feet ahead. Uh, north, so. If I moved it there, it would have partial cover. But alas, I can't move it anymore. Yep. If I move here, does it have partial cover? Uh, if you move here, you don't. It doesn't. Yeah. 
Because if you well, if you go I, down, I would like to move more towards the rest of this. Uh, let's see. If you go here, oh, or from here. Uh, here. Yeah, that'll work. Put your shot in there, and then I and then I can miss again. Uh, from here, let's see. Uh, it did get hit last round, so it does not ha gets to use its ability. You may take your shot. That's a hit. Yay! Hey! Go ahead and roll this. And I'm going to use Favored Foe. Oh? Because I want it dead. Okay. Ah, uh, you go. That adds the 1d4 on a hit. Five plus. Roll that 1d4. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Six damage. That's bad. That's Six good. Six damage. That uh, panther like creature, you lose that arrow and you strike it in one of its the back of its legs. Because it's at such low health, it clambers to the ground against a tree, but it's still alive. It's a big. It is a, a big, big boy. It, it's prone now. It's okay. prone against the tree. So powder, you yes. are having a a bit of a odd face off because you're twenty feet there in the air. Exactly. <laughs> the powder face. The off. the the hound below you is just. He looks up at you, barks, <laughs> and then goes this way, dashing towards the others. Oh, wait. Amazing. He, he can't reach you? <laughs> <laughs> Just as I planned. <laughs> but it does get All right the of you. decay, Kaku. Oh, the... Yagami. Now Orpheus' turn. Camberwell, you're next. Mm hmm Oh. Uh no, not powder. Uh powders is dead. I didn't make anyone else roll strength checks. Uh for the sake of it. Rosary, Horfrost, and Squall, I need you all to roll strength checks. Alright. Why? Well, time to fail this. The I don't have a now. deer. Wait. Not you. Me. I didn't say powder. I didn't say powder. You said powder. No, you said you're squall. not talking to powder. You're talking to. Someone. You're talking to squall. Squalls. Yeah, you have a deer, right? I don't have it. I don't have a deer. I ran to the thing. Okay. Oh, I have a deer. So, mud puppy, you you're you do. Horfrost has one. Rosary has one. Yes. Somebody left behind a deer. <laughs> hey, somebody... uh, that's me. I think that might be me. No, you have it. Unless oh. Camberwell said he picked it up and I missed it. Nope. Okay, so one deer was left behind because Orpheus didn't. All pick right. It up. All right, we left the deer. Yeah, okay, we left so the deer. Now we got to defend the deer. Uh, Rosary, hmm. the the net you're holding shakes so much you have to drop it, but it's still in the net. Horfrost. Yay! You still, got you still got yours. You're holding fine. Me. No, Horfrost. You're I know. you already made the check, you're fine. Uh where is Orpheus's sheet? There it is. Uh he's gonna go. Here. <laughs> and Wait, he's I roll a ten, huh? Use... Toll the dead on the hurt one. Oh, the dead kill. 
Uh, he did make a damage roll for this, so we'll just do 1d12 because it's hurt. Seven, Seven. necrotic damage. Let it melt. Dong. Ding dong. Yeah. The Taco Bell. Dong. <laughs> Boing. That's, yeah, that's canon now. Every, no. Just a fucking Taco Bell. Now. Uh, and the creature itself actually has to make a save. Again. Uh, it, it, it doesn't break free. Camberwell, it is now your turn. All right, Rose just making sure dead. these two are alive still, right? Both of them are alive, and one is not wounded. The other is kind of taking hits. It is the the one that is still under his control. So the if it's one point twelve or the seven point twelve, which one is it in initiative? Uh, the oh, first one, the twenty one. Yeah, okay, thank so, you. If they're within the 30 for my hand crossbow range. Yes, they are both in. I'm fine to hit them with that. Yes. Alright, I'm going to go for that then. On uh, this one. Which one? Okay. Oh, right, hold on. Crown uh, boy. One. That's the one with the crown on top of it. Yeah. So I guess I should yeah. put a status effect on him just to make sure everyone knows. Uh, we'll oops. do this one. This one has the crown on it. Or because that's a trophy, but whatever. Alright, I got a 15 on the hand. That does hit. Alright, so roll for damage now. Dang. Oh, you... that's a sad one. <laughs> it's be... Very sad. Uh, but it does do thought this creature was a bit resistant, but it's not. He takes the full damage as you uh -huh. shoot it in the shoulder, but the, the arrow that you just shot burns in its shoulder and just is not usable anymore. Alright. That is a sad boy lose one arrow. And that'll be all for my turn. Okay, Rosary. Yes. Your turn. All right, so I'll move my weapon to this one because the other one's probably still charmed. Okay. And I'm gonna bonk that one <laughs> with my weapon. Bonky donkey. I mean, it's pretty much a bonking stick at this point. <laughs> it is a mace. But that's a mace. Uh, <laughs> Well, that didn't work. Sad. You do have a normal attack now. It That's a... right in front of you. Uh, I'll just use my mace then, because I'm too close for a crossbow shot. That's a crit. <laughs> what? <laughs> natural <laughs> 1 into a natural 20. Every time. <clears throat> Yay! <laughs> Works 100% of the time, every time. That's 10 damage. And the one in front of you? Or Yeah, the one in front. Know. Okay. I mean, actually, no, let's get the one that's charmed. So, <laughs> so the one in front of me. Okay, it is dreams. very wounded now. <laughs> You're a mace. You just bashed its lower jaw into its other just... jaw. We're beating the shit out of him. How are you not dead? I'm a healer, right? I'm the healer? <laughs> Where did he... Alright, uh, it is now All right, that's a... that hound's turn. But have you never been healed so good that you just died? Yeah, you're Orpheus right. Orpheus is looking at that hound, and the hound turns to the other hound and that hound well, it can't do it, the thing, so uh, it's gonna bite the other hound. Question. It's Question. 
Okay, so does that hound still count as its ally? I think so, yeah. I mean... Ends. Yeah. What does the other hound think do they, of this? Do they get bonuses for being your allies? If that hound still counts as its ally for while being attacked by an ally... From an <laughs> It's weird. For the sake of this, I won't do that, because that's too confusing. Uh, because they both have pack tactics. So it will just make a normal bite attack. It did not need the pack tactics. Yeah, pack tactics doesn't work when attacking allies. Oh my god, this thing just did a lot of damage. Uh, I'm glad it's not biting us. Yes, indeed. Yep. That is 13 piercing and 12 fire damage. But is clearly immune to the fire. It takes no extra damage, though. Just... Oh, wait. Uh, okay. It doesn't take much extra damage from that fire. But that's all that hound can do, because it just attacked its ally. And... Bitch! Is that enough? <laughs> Hold on. That does mean... Uh, the save it just made, it is no longer charmed. Mud Puppy. And Powder yep. Unfortunate. Oh. Alright, that's it. Because I'm still... I'm going to... I'm going to bash this hound's head in with the mate with Warhammer. Okay, make your attack. 14, that is a miss. Oh. I, I cannot, I did not, I was not able to smite him, sadly. You were not able to. Anything else? It's like, could, could, uh, I don't think I can. can, so. Like, no, it's like, I cannot cast Shield of Faith. Okay. No, because you have uh, Divine Faith unless you want to drop it, or not favor. No. I'm, I'm keeping Divine Favor. I'm yes. going to remove the Displacer Beast from combat, because well, it's sitting uh, up there, basically dying. I'm gonna move here as I I think I'm just gonna fall straight down to the ground. Um okay. from twenty feet? This is only twenty feet. Okay, the first remember the first five is kind of a free drop. It's more than five, Zavi. Yeah, I know. I'm just saying the first five is free. No no no. The it's the it's more than five that's free for the first distance. It's like ten. Hmm. Well, since you're dropping to the ground, you will drop this turn while flying or while moving, so I mean, it's not all the way down. Like, I get... I think I get... 10... I can get 10 feet down, I think. Normally. And then drop the the rest 10. Okay. And that way... that If you do that, you will take... Well, no. Yeah. If you do that, then you take uh, the 1d6 bludgeoning fall damage. Because it's still 10 feet. Man, where are these rules you're using? Because they're not normal. Fall damage? For the fall damage? Yeah, that's that doesn't sound right. Fall damage is one, a d6 for every 10 feet, isn't it? I don't think so. Let me make sure. And if it is, it's not for the first 10 feet. Now remember, I'm, I'm only actually falling 10 feet. Yeah, I'm just going to make sure. Fall from a great height at the end of a fall, creature takes 1d6 bludgeoning damage for every 10 feet it fell. So, I don't know. It is every 10 feet. That's what I'm seeing here. So, I think it might be 1d6 okay, for 10 well, feet. Fuck the simplified rules then. Because <laughs> they suck.
It's already... I'm also raging, so... Also, uh... You're raging now? Yes. We're, we're at least, like, ten feet tall, so, like... I can hit that thing from here. It's falling body height. Yeah, but he's still ten feet in the air. If, if you want to say you're still ten feet in the air, you can. I, I won't... I mean... Can't hit it if I'm ten feet in the air. Well, you can't reach it this turn anyways. Yes, I can. Okay. I have a reach weapon, bitch. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Are you fine with taking the bludgeoning damage, then? Hit me. Hit you. I <laughs> killed him. <laughs> Immediate Ray. regret. Six, ah. reduced, six reduced to three. Okay. All right. Uh, Roll for that hit. Yes. Oh. Hello? Hello? Hit the button. It's not. There it is. There okay. 16. Might no, just be like. That's 16. 16. Super. Uh, that's pretty good. Uh, you cleave that thing right across its side. Deal a hefty amount of damage. Yes. Your blade, you pull it up, and you kind of look at it. It's kind of hot to the touch now. It's kind of red. Poor Frost. I don't think I'm looking at the tip of the blade. I think I'm still looking at my victim. That too. You're looking at the victims. It's blood. What? That's all the red is. It's, that's all the blood used the reds you see. What's not red? <laughs> what is red? Uh, let's see. What are Empathy, frogs? Rosary, Orpheus, Squall, or Frost. None of them are red. <laughs> uh, returning hand X. Oh, you, okay. You're just gonna smack the one in front of you. Okay, that does hit. Roll damage. Nine. That hound pain. squeals in pain, and just push that axe in a little bit more, and it and then it just stops making any noise and. Slumps down. God. Joyce. <laughs> jo sobs tears of joy. Oh, on the other one? Okay. You take. Uh, you're gonna do the rend attack, I believe. Yep, that's another Force. hit. He don't miss! Only three damage, though. But it's good damage. Force is but it's good, good damage. Indeed. Okay. Good shit. I do believe that was your turn, so it is Squall's turn. Ah. Ah. It, it's everybody is just on the side that's closest to me. Yep. It's pretty hard to see that uh, hound from here. There, are, it's kind of surrounded by a lot of dragons. Right yeah, now. it's 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 more the issue of that's if I can even stand on top of a dead hound, that's thirty five feet. Um, <clears throat> cricket. I can be more useless later. What did you do? Uh, Zephyr Strike. Ooh, Zephyr Strike. Okay. Mm. Go ahead. Make your move. <laughs> uh, wait, that's a dash. No, Zephyr Strike gives me increased walking speed of 30 feet. Only when you hit when you're using the extra damage. Oh, okay. Well, then I did. you hit or miss. Yeah, if you hit or miss, you get the extra move speed. Right. For that turn. Um. So if I moved... Here? 
You could hit it from there. Well, I could also miss it from there, but we'll see. You do, in fact, miss it from there, but you do get the 30 bonus move speed anyways. You can move. Okay, so let's see. You're gonna move there. Uh, this hound is completely surrounded. It just saw its friend die. Uh, Ooh. it is going to. Stay in range. Uh, well, it hasn't done its thing yet. I'm going to need. To... You know what? Uh, can it move that diagonal? No. Can it? Okay, it doesn't leave anything's range except the missile chain, so it, it does this. But then it can. Okay. Oh, did I just use that I wrong? Am... No. Do I need to right. use the do I need to use the once before it ends I can give myself advantage to get the movement? For one minute you don't provoke any attack of opportunities, and once during that minute you get to activate extra damage if you hit. No, it, it gives give yourself advantage on one weapon attack roll. Oh. Yes. I didn't notice yeah. the advantage. Okay, yeah. Uh so sh should I have done that? Yeah, go yeah. ahead and roll again. So just like a normal roll again. Yeah, yeah, just do a normal roll. That one did hit. So roll the extra damage and all that. Oh. Well, good thing you noticed. Oh. Because this thing's fucking dead now. <laughs> Yay! We did it! Do, 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 do. Finally, instead! We did it! Instead. And the hunt is over. But you do we still have it. a giant panther like beast that's still alive over there. It, we did it. Don't worry, Abby. If it's still not that's there. A, or if it ran like, away by now. It's like, uh, we did I it. I want to head out after this combat. Okay. I was hoping to get a little bit more. Right. That would. Uh, thank you. Good morning. Did we earn any XP from that? N not yet. So we have four hundred. Like, if you want to write it, down. wasn't there a deer still in a bag that we're trying to like? Yeah. Uh, for... Zavi, if you want, you can control camera well. I'd like everyone to be here for the conversation that's probably about to happen, but at least. Cheesy. Oh, has great. My yeah. fucking headset disconnected. Hold on, I can't hear you. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's fine. If you want to head out, we're just gonna. Wrap okay, what'd you up. say, Zavi? We're just gonna wrap things up. Gonna wrap it up. Yeah. Boom. We'll get everyone going back to the prey center because that was the hunt. Because the hunt is over. Yep. <laughs> but there is the matter of the. Uh, Beast that Squall really wants to kill. As you approach it, Squall, it is still currently against the tree with uh, an arrow sticking out of its left leg or back leg. It has six legs. It just kind of looks up at you and snarls at you. Orpheus is right behind you. Ken? Yeah. Did you catch all that? Yes. Well, 
What do you do? Everyone else is, uh... Just existing. Yeah. I'm going to say... Staring at the corpses. Uh, Camberwell. Mm. Uh, I'm going to... Uh, Camberwell and Orpheus are actually... Well, yeah, Orpheus will go with Camberwell to go get the deer that they left behind together. It's not that far away. For the sake of that, if anyone wants to write it down, uh, that is... I mean, this is this... Six, no seven hundred and fifty XP from this battle. Okay, three hundred and fifty. Seven hundred and fifty. Is that combined you. with four hundred? The four hundred from last time? Yes. Okay. I had two hundred written was... down from last time. I, I, I updated it. It's four hundred from last time. Okay. My bad. So one hundred fifty plus seven fifty equals eleven fifty. Uh, right, if, if Wait, we the, kill this, uh, that, are we going to be feasibly able to bring it back? I already added the uh, XP from that, too. It wasn't a lot. Uh, well... From what? With all the deer, uh, there's five deer. Uh, as they come back, they're carrying one. If the thing is still alive, too, so yeah, if it's alive, it'll take more of you to carry. Yeah, I'm wondering if, like, if I would think it's feasible that we can carry it back dead, and is it beneficial possible. at all? It's probably possible. It Looking at it and the deers, the deers are like half its size. Looking at over, this is worth at least maybe four deers. Okay, so it looks edible. It looks edible. Okay. It looks fairly edible. I mean, your dragon's not very picky about what you eat. If you see a creature, you just eat it, really. Unless it's particularly untasty. So, at a close enough range, since it's prone, do I still have disadvantage on ranged attack? Yes. If a creature's prone, it's disadvantage on ranged attacks. <laughs> you could still go for it anyway, it's just to do it. <laughs> you could use this a cruel way of thinking about it is archery practice for a disadvantage strike. Yeah, let's go. No. But you'd probably not do that. You could probably just walk up and very easily slit its throat. It looks very weak. Okay. It won't bite. Yeah, I'd just do that then. Okay. So you just slowly pull out a knife and just... Or you could use your claw. Well, can I just use my claw? Yeah, Yeah, you can just use your claw and just cut into its neck into a certain spot and it just slowly closes its eyes. It's going to take at least three of you to carry that thing. Camberwell and Orpheus can help. Powder is 
might be able to carry two deer by himself. Maybe. How how much strength is required to not be encumbered by one deer? Just curious. Fifteen. Ah, okay. Damn it. That's <laughs> <laughs> like Thanks. Yes, it's a demon doggo. We get it. <laughs> no, it's a damn it. Oh, yeah, but after those hounds are dead, my puppy, you look at one. You just, you just yes. kind of can't pull away from it. I can't. <laughs> you just kind of stare there, standing at it. Or stand there staring at it. Staring there, I staring still have, at it. I still have a net, so, like, Powder could, like, put the dead deer in a net. Yeah, Powder could put his deer in a net. If he wants to, he's just kind of holding on to it. I think the net would help with carrying two of them. Uh, that mm, it it would help carry two, but if you're trying to close it, it won't close all the way. No, I mean like so, if he's carrying two nets. Oh, carrying two nets. As opposed to carrying one that isn't in a net and carrying a net with one. Oh, powder. Or does that not help at all? I mean, it's the same weight. And the nets are pretty heavy. Okay. And the net's not going to do anything with this big thing. Yeah, no, it's not going to fit. Uh, speaking of, the, the nets are attributing to the weight of the deers, and they're not very light. <laughs> uh, I might go ahead and head out. Okay. Don't have hey. fun. Thank you. Yeah, we're just putting things around up here. Yep. And have a good one. Head back Hello, to the Prey Center next time. Uh, okay. which so Orpheus can carry a deer unless Powder wants to carry two. I can carry two. It doesn't make any difference to me. Um, yeah, you can carry two. Where's our XP sitting? Uh, Where's last this? time you got four hundred. This time we got the total. This time we got 750. So that alone think... is 1150. And I think plus, we started with 150. Plus everyone's 150 from the start, which is 1300. Yeah, 1300. Okay. That's what I thought. All right, how much do you, all right, how much do you expect to level up? Wait. What is uh, 3 What's the 150 from the start? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't give you any? Uh, I think you may have. It's uh, That's like already applied though, right? Yeah. I think 1,800 is level 4. 2,800. 28? Okay. Yeah. Behind a little bit. What, did, what was I missing? Uh, you guys will be level 4 by the time you leave. Oh, that's uh, what I missed. It's I, I, know, not... I know when you guys are going to be level 4. That's about all I've got. <laughs> Yeah. So, uh, if Powder carries two, that means three of you can carry the Panther, which is Orpheus, Camberwell, and Squall. And the rest of you can carry a deer. Yes! 2700? I thought it was 2800. No! I forgot! We got, yeah. or at least I had a hundred or eleven hundred because of the AXP at the start, and what we got, I think, through last session or the session before, plus seven hundred fifty. That would be in the two thousands mm -hmm. if we add the seven fifty. Mm. What did you get? I might have gotten my numbers wrong. Okay, last time it was a 400. Everyone got that. Everyone yes. Got yeah, 100 did we get, from the did first we, session. Did we get any? Everyone started with 900 What's... XP. Oh, okay. Did we get because any for the 150 from like the, the individual intros, or is the 150 from the first session? That is the in intros. Oh, okay. sorry. So we got nothing we from the first session. So we have a thousand five. So it's the nine hundred plus the one fifty, which is uh -huh. eleven fifty. Well, no, ten fifty. 
plus the 400, which is 1450. That's 2200. 750 today. Yeah, I'm just asking to confirm we got no experience in the first session we did. No, because there was no fight or anything. All right. Okay, so we were yeah, 220. 20, two hundred twenty. Twenty two two thousand two hundred. Yeah, two thousand two hundred at this point. Yes. Okay. And I'll put these two next to this. And you guys all have a deer. Okay. We got deer. Yeah. I what do we do with me, Cody? I dare say that was a successful hunt. It's like only one deer got away. Only one deer, but it's only one deer. It was a it was a little mini deer. Uh, and also, we wouldn't technically be able to carry it, so. Still staring at, still staring at the hell ha at the hound. Did you want to do anything about that? <laughs> so all of you are, I guess, rejoicing in the kill of this hunt. Yeah, rejoice. Who is just kind of, again, standing and staring. <laughs> Red Woods and Scale. <laughs> We're in Red Woods territory. We're... They aren't like super tall. They're like 50 feet tall. Are we they're in California? Tall trees, but they're not redwood trees. Not yet. Close. Yeah, they look. <laughs> it's fucking stairs. The boys in California. The rainforest is basically redwood trees, if we're yes. putting things into that scale. Yeah. This, in comparison, is a tiny forest. Little baby, baby forest. Oh. I like how the I like how the shadows just make trees look like little. Yeah. Well, my birds are being annoyed. I think I will end the stream here and we'll call it a night. Okay. All right. All right.